Granulomatous mastitis, GM, is an uncommon benign chronic inflammatory breast disease first described by Kessler and Wallach in 1972 that can mimic inflammatory breast cancer and periductal mastitis. The most common presenting symptom is a large tender lump, often several centimeters in diameter. Often this is associated with overlying skin changes of erythema and ulceration. Sinuses can develop, with discharge from the lesions. The cause may be the autoimmune process, infection, a chemical reaction associated with oral contraceptive pills, or even lactation. Granulomatous mastitis is an episodic breast disease mostly affecting premenopausal women. Patients can have severe symptoms for a while, but then symptoms clear up with or without treatment and the breasts almost return to normal. Previous studies indicated that there might be a possible association between breast cancer and GM. In a study, Handley demonstrated that three out of five sisters with chronic mastitis developed breast cancer during the follow-up. GM is diagnosed by ultrasound mammogram and biopsy histopathology only. The disease is characterized by formation of a non-necrotizing granuloma in combination with a localized infiltrate of multinucleated giant cells, epithelioid histocytes. Depending on the clinical presentation, Patients may appropriately be initially managed with antibiotics, attempted incision and drainage, biopsy, or excision.